little bit hot, hot. Uh, hot. <laughs> oh. Maybe I should get something to put it on. Yeah. So the idea is to uh, be vaccinated first before you can go into the bag. Yesterday I saw on uh, Instagram somebody posted uh, something about a place called Melodon Park in Abuja. This Melodon Park has been shut down since 2020 when COVID came so they shut this place down and I saw somebody say oh the place is open and so this morning I drove here I just wanted to see if the place is open and if it's open have they improved upon the things that are there and to sh share with you guys what the place was like to tell the story of what it was and what it is now and uh, show you if there's any improvement or not wait right now we are walking towards the entrance i can saw some people about to enter but they call them aside i don't know whether they're asking them to register or something whatever it is we'll find out when we get there yes so those people are in the can go now yeah. okay so the idea is to uh, be vaccinated first before you can go right, into the park you. shall we go what if you so what what is what have they done did they vaccinate have. Yeah. you have already yeah, so what is it like you fill the form and you get injected or something right yes. Yes. bros <laughs> i know i already ate <laughs> what if we do the test and then it, it, what do we do do the test we do the pcr test the and it's negative eh? so if we do a test and we don't have covid we must still do this thing yes. may i'm finish if i don't have the covid it's to protect you now. No, 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 I don't have it now. So, what? It's to stay protected. It's to protect you. Maybe somebody has it. You, if you really take it. Bros, bros. You have to get the vaccine. You have to get the No, wait. Let's, let's, let's analyze it. Okay. Imagine 100 people are inside. They already have the vaccine, right? Yes. And me, I've tested. I don't have it. So, why am I afraid? They, they already tested. They don't have it. Go. Me, I don't have it. I've been tested. And they are vaccinated. So, what? It's, so, I don't can you reason with me i beg i don't know i don't go to school for afternoon can you reason with me i want to understand why it is like that okay. it's not from us though. i know i know i know it's just a rule you guys are just doing but i'm just asking let's just reason i i understand that you have to do this to enter but i'm just asking you know so what they already vaccinated me i test i don't have covid uh, you don't need it like because as in you don't take the vaccine because you don't have COVID. Those people taking the vaccine, it's not that they have COVID, you understand? But you take the vaccine so as to stand as a protection for for, for you against the COVID. Like, in case you come and come down with the, the people someone, who have had it, who have had the vaccine, they keep having they the COVID. Yeah, the thing is that but even yes. if you've taken the vaccine and yeah. still you are infected without COVID, it's not going to be as chronic as someone that has never taken the vaccine. Okay, now let's put it this way, yeah. Okay. Whether I like it or not, in Nigeria, most of us have had this COVID and we've recovered. Yes. Do you That's know that, right? Yeah. <laughs> so if we've had it, our immunity is a lot better than those that have not had it, right? Yeah. So if I do a PCR test, tells you that I don't have it. Does that not make me enough to go into a place like this? Can I mean, I'm just yeah, asking. Yeah, I'm just yeah. Like, I'm not saying you should go against your yeah, rule, though. I'm just reasoning with yes, you. I know. Yeah. I know. So if one take one dose now, they can go in. Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is like how the card is. Oh, is it this one? Yes. yes. Okay. Okay. Covid nineteen vaccine. Okay. This for somebody. I've already filled. So, <laughs> bros, well, let me tell you, eh, yesterday I saw it on Instagram, somebody said they've opened this place, that's why I came. Yeah, yeah. Normally, I'll just sit in my house, for two years now, I know they have not opened. And I go to other parts, I go to children's zoo, yeah. eh, I just say, let me come and see. Mm -hmm. I talk. They, they asked me 
You know, that's this thing, it's, no, it's, not, it's not only here. Uh, one day Most might decide to travel out. You know, this thing. That one, no, no problem. Whether they go, I don't say I go, I go take out. Yeah. <laughs> As I did, say, oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's true now. I, I'll do my PCR today. They know I, I don't have it. Whatever they say, I should. Now me, they go, now me, they go their country. Even if you don't have it. Wait, bros. Now me, they go their country. Yeah. I, I go take out because I they go their country. But within here, but when I calm down now. So even if I do a test, it's negative, nothing. Ah, now wow. All right, oh, thank you very much for the enlightenment. Yes. All right. <laughs> yeah. I decided not to. I've, I've done a PCR test before, and I'm negative. I why? I, I don't want to take take it now. Yes, I know if I'm traveling out, I will take it, right? But just a pack. Okay, the question I asked asked her was that if ten people are in there, they've already taken the vaccine, and me, I've done PCR test. I don't have it. Why can't I go in? Because right now, I asked them, let me do a PCR test to show that I don't have it. They said no. I said, it's not that. I think it's just another way of making people to get vaccinated. That's that what it is. So, you guys know now, this is the condition for you to be able to get into the Millennium Park. It's not like there is a zoo or something. It's just a place where you go, maybe sit down, have some fun. You just sit down and chill, uh, relax. It's not... Um, it's a good place to go hang out because I've done a video here before. That was like uh, a few years ago. Uh, I've done a video here, but to be asked to take this before you get into the place, I I totally disagree. I totally disagree. Yes, a lot of people will take it and go in there because if you really want to go in here, you just have to take it really, right? But I don't think I really want to take it because I want to go in there. See, if I want to, I'll make up my mind and come back and and do that but not probably here i'll go to a proper place and take the vaccine they're not here all right that's the condition for entering the park all right guys um fortunately after they asked us to not to go in because we didn't take the uh, uh, vaccine that they're offering here i saw this guy uh, with his wife and kids uh, so I went to meet him. Fortunately, ah, he's, he's a subscriber, so we talked and he told me that he just came in from the UK, that he had to do um, a PCR test when he came, got into the country and is negative. Before he left the UK, he did a test and all that. So why are they forcing him here to get a vaccine to get into a park like this? And he told them that he's wrong. Okay, moreover, what law are you guys following? Is there a gazette or something written by the government so that you can have a copy here and show people that this is what the government has said? And they said they don't have it and they directed him to speak with the security guard. He spoke with the guy and the guy just said, it's the law. What, what freaking law? So he decided to go back with his family. So they're just there, they're about to leave. So I left them behind now. So that's it. This place here that they've locked up for like two years, they're about to open now and all they're doing is coming up with cock and bull story of you need to get a vaccine before you can step into a park and a, an open space it is not like an enclosed space a wide open space crazy they don't even understand what that means Here's the thing the reason why i came here is this you know i i know i was at the uh, millennium park that was just recently reopened but when they told us that we needed to get uh, vaccinated before you can uh, step into the place and you know i don't even trust what they're going to be injecting you honestly speaking because first of all i don't know who they are they are not health officials we know what, what, whatever you know so it's crazy that they somebody wants to make me take a vaccine just outside not knowing what they're going to inject into my body so that was one of the reasons i will refuse to take the vaccine and i wanted and i thought about it instead of just stopping the video there i decided why not come and show somewhere else you can come to and have good fun 
without having to go through that process. Honestly, I, I even believe this place is a lot better. The uh, anyway, let's let's go in there and see what the place is like. This is just the car park, so a lot of cars here today. Uh, like I said, the the this place to get in adult you pay. Uh, let's go this way. For adults you pay 500 naira, for kids 300. It used to be 200 for adults, 100 naira for kids. I was like, before COVID, and now they've increased it, which is fine because they did a lot of repair. I think I made a video about someone who comes to feed the lions or the animals here some time back. I'll put the link in the description so you guys can see that. So we're just gonna walk around so that, the reason for my walking around is so that you guys can see that yes this place is actually this place is actually a better place to to be than that park they are asking you to be vaccinated before you enter so you guys can see behind there that's also rock see in front of me see how this place is built they have this umbrella like place and it's like a lookout place where you can actually come in and uh, take a look at you have ostriches here because you can see the sign there okay look at them there I know the lions are there, but normally when it's wow, I think I can see it's so big now, so huge. I think I have to zoom into this thing so that you guys can see it's so huge. I like this thing, they used to have a lot of pigeons living in them, but I don't know whether they are there now. But let me show you guys this. See how huge this tortoise is. Can you guys see that? They also used to have rabbits in these cages, but I don't know. Yeah, I can't see anyone there now. Wow, look at the biggest turtle there. Let me go and show you guys. Let's go. Let me show you. Guys, see the turtle, see the biggest one here. Let me zoom into it so you guys can see that. Wow, can you guys see it? That's massive. Crazy. And there are smaller ones here. Like I can see like three. And I see very small, small ones at the corner there. Let's go, Hans. Let's, let's go. So maybe you guys can see it from here. Yeah. You can see two of them or so. Stuck somewhere there. A lot of them here though. Alright. Let's go. Okay, let me see what's in here. This this place never shut down during this COVID, I think. Maybe they did for a while, but thereafter. They always when things resumed everybody everywhere resumed and people started moving around and people coming to these places here they are supposed to have oh, okay good you guys can see them some monkeys some stream i will call them stream monkeys two of them just walking well i think i need to get closer that you guys can see them okay they're even coming this way Ooh, okay let's see I'm walking towards them. Look, they're eating something from those flowers here. I'm not sure you guys. Look at one for so sweet. Look at so cute. It's a small one. You can pass that thing now. That's why it's Okay, they can jump. There's one there. 
and there's this tiny one here. Hey donkey. Hey. How are you? Okay, I don't have anything for you guys. Okay. Something for you. Let me see whether it's something you like, do you? Okay. Cool. Okay, let's go. Let me go. Hey, bye. There is this place in front of me. Let me just show you from afar. Um, it's, it's like a driveway with some trees so beautiful. I took some pictures here, I think, just before COVID. Beautiful picture. I think if I look for it, I can find a picture. I'll put it so you guys can see. I took a picture just where these trees are all the way down. Wow, I love this view of the Aso Rock. This is so nice. I don't know, maybe some people don't have this. Okay, here's it. I love things like this. I love rocks, I love rivers, I love lakes. Those are the things that I really like. And these are the things you get when you come to a park. They don't ask you to, <laughs> they don't restrict your entrance. Anyway, if you're watching, if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed to this channel, please, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button. And if you have been watching these videos for a long time and you're a subscriber and you want to support me, I've been looking for ways to. There's a join button just beside the subscribe button. You can hit that, then you help in uh, supporting the channel. Let's go. Just think of the sound, the only sound you get to hear when you're here. Can you guys hear that? Birds chirping. Apart from the other sound of somebody packing things there. So, we are just here now trying to just uh, spend some time before we show you the other part of this place um, like I suggested it is better to come here than to go to the other place where you'll be forced to do what you don't want to do and then <laughs> you're not even sure what they're gonna be putting in your body so I think this is a good place to come the reason why I decided to come here was just to make a comparison and show you guys that look if that place doesn't work, there's always an alternative. There's always somewhere else one can come and spend some time, and which is the Children Park and Zoo here in Asokoro. It's actually located close to the Army Barrack. Or you have to pass through the Army Barrack. When you come in, you can Google uh, Parks and Recreation Asokoro to show you to direct you here. There's also a checkpoint where you're there, the military checkpoint where you're actually entering like a barrack. Um, you may be asked where you're going to, just a Parks and Recreation. They will let you in so you just drive on straight into the gate and you find your way here you follow the video you can also get here too it's that simple all right let me shut the camera down for a while spend some time then on our way out i'll show you some other places okay this part here is a picnic area where people can just come hire mats sit down have a picnic or something you know that's what they do normally here because it's even written there picnic area keep it clean see these ones there they're just setting up their mats as the rock as a rock itself behind them there Let me go and ask them if the sewer is for sale or they are doing it for themselves. Yeah, it doesn't look it doesn't look as if it's for sale. I think 
they are having maybe a program or something. The only reason I'm saying that because they, this guy is this guy. <laughs> I'm going to ask though. I have to ask though. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Please I want to ask, is it for sale or you guys are having a... Oh, you having a oh, private? Okay, okay. All right. Oh, I thought I thought it was for sale. I wanted to get some bit. It's not. All right. Let me end this video here, guys. Subscribe to this channel if you have enough. Oh, thank you. He <laughs> just offered me. Thank you very much. <laughs> Maybe it's not the trick. You get it. Get it. Okay. Oh. Thank you very much. Okay. I thought. I thought. Little bit hot, hot. Uh, hot. <laughs> Maybe I should get something to put it on. Yeah. Okay, a stick. Okay. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. What's the name? Shakir. 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 A turkey. A turkey. Okay, yeah. nice. I'm big wheels. Thank you. Nice. To meet Maybe you. my video. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, bye. <laughs> All right, they offered me this, guys. Yeah, we're gonna have some. <laughs> Let's do this. It's hot, though. Mm. Wow. See the power of asking. If I'm not going to have to ask, I wouldn't have had this stuff. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the like button so that you can appreciate us for what we do. And also if you want to support your boy, there's a join button underneath. You can just click that and support us. Thank you for watching today's video. See you guys in the very next one. Ciao. Subscribe, like, share, comment, see you in the next one.